Today is November the 23rd, the day before Thanksgiving, and I have embarked upon a new hobby, and that is coin roll hunting. Uh, you can see I've got my first boxes of halves that I'm going to go through in just a little bit, but I want to show you what I went through yesterday when I went to the bank, and I, and I got a, a few coins. Uh, there was nothing in the coins, but at least I... Um, got a couple of half dollars here and I just wanted you to see that it's easy to look at the end of a coin and realize that it's got copper in it these are called copper clad coins and these are coins that were minted in 1971 and later all the coins prior to that year had silver in them the, and I'm just speaking of dimes and quarters and half dollars at the moment up until 1964, they contained 90% silver, and due to the shortage of silver, or the expense of silver, the government decided to uh, eliminate silver in the dimes and the quarters. So in the years 1965 and on, there's no silver in a dime or a quarter. But since the half dollar had Kennedy's face on it, they decided, no, they cannot get away from silver but they came to a compromise that they would reduce the silver in 1966 from 90% to 40%. So they put 40% silver in the half dollars in 1966, 67, 68, 69, and 70. And then Congress finally decided to do away with silver altogether to make the half dollar uh, the same alloys as the dimes and quarters so at that point there was no silver in any of the coins so as a coin roll hunter what we're trying to do is just find coins that uh, contain silver uh, at least a pre an appreciable amount of silver and they be and they're worth something went to um, Wells Fargo Bank and they had one roll of halves that someone had just turned in and uh, I, had, I bought it and I got back to the car and when I opened it up I was looking for coins hopefully that didn't have any clad in them and lo and behold what I found was all of them were silver all 20 coins and they were dated 19 66 and later which meant all of these coins have 40 percent silver that's a unusual find it's very rare to buy one roll and have all 20 coins contain silver so now i'm going to begin opening the boxes and just see how many silver coins i can find and i'll let you know when i find some coins what you're looking for immediately are the ones that are on the end of the roll. These are called enders. And when you see one like a Ben Franklin, you know that's a 90% silver coin. And if we look over here, you can see another Ben Franklin. So we know that is a 90%er. And on the back of a Ben Franklin is the Liberty Bell. So we know that one is also a 90% silver. Uh, when someone when, when you find a coin that's got a mark on it someone has probably looked at this coin before and marked it So they wouldn't waste time looking at the date again And look here's the most special one in this box This is a walking Liberty half dollar because the Eagle is on one side and the walking Liberty is on the other side so this box uh, so contains seemingly a lot of silver Another thing to look for is that you'll see a coin that has no silver in it has a very shiny uh, back to it, like this eagle. But if you look at the one right next to it, where it's kind of dull, that's indicating to me that that's going to be silver as well. Maybe a 40 percenter, but silver nonetheless. Now in these boxes, the coins are half size, so there's other rolls down inside. And let's see what that one is down there. Oh my goodness, would you look down in there? That's an eagle. 
That is a 90% silver coin down in there. And on the other side of it is a walking Lady Liberty. These are rare coins, but they're 90% silver. This looks like a good box. I'll start opening them and let you know what we find. Now what you're looking for when you open a roll of coins is you're looking for the copper clad and then you're looking for one that is not copper clad which is uh, a silver coin so I think that the one on the end open it up and it is a 1964 this is a 90 percent silver coin there's another silver in here This is a Ben Franklin, a 90% coin. This is a 1954 Ben Franklin. There's another one that looks like a Walking Lady Liberty, a 1936, a 90% silver coin. Beautiful. So that's three out of the first roll that I've opened and I'm not through yet. What is this one? It's a 1964 Kennedy, which is a 90% coin. And here's one more. Oh my goodness, this one is also a Lady Liberty, a 1942 Lady Liberty. Isn't that a beautiful coin? 90% silver. I don't see any more. So in this first roll, I've got five 90% silvers, two Kennedys, one Benjamin Franklin, and two walking Lady Liberties. The ones that we opened had four Benjamin Franklins and two walking Lady Liberties, all 90% coins in the second roll. Coins that we opened had a Walking Lady Liberty, a Benjamin Franklin, and a Barber 1808. 1908. 1908 a Barber 1908, half dollar, all 90% coins. Had two Benjamin Franklin and three Walking Lady Liberty, all 90% silver. Roll that we opened had four Benjamin Franklins and one Kennedy 1964, all 90% silver three Walking Lady Liberties and a Ben Franklin, all 90% silver. Three had two Benjamin Franklins, two Walking Lady Liberties, and one Kennedy, 1964, all 90% silver. Had three Benjamin Franklins, one Walking Lady Liberty, one Kennedy, 1964, all 90% silver. And had one Benjamin Franklin and one Walking Lady Liberty. Old hunter of all. How many coins do you have? I got three. You found three? Do you know what they are? Can you tell me? Help me, Mom. Tell, uh, tell them what they are. Ben Franklin, Kennedy, and a Walking Liberty. Can you say that? Say what? Walking Liberty. Walking Liberty. Kennedy. Kennedy. Ben Franklin. Okay, Lockin, Emily. Ben Franklin, out ben of Franklin. one roll. Good job. You just opened another roll. How many coins did you get out of there? Five. Sh show them to me. A bell. A bell, okay, we like bells. A bone. A what? A bone. A bird, yeah, we like that eagle. A walking liberty. A walking liberty? <laughs> a eagle. Another eagle. A walking liberty. A walking liberty. How many coins is that? Count them. One, two, three, four, five. In one roll. You, I want you to open all the rolls. Number 37. I'm still on the first box. We've got 13 rolls still remaining, and we've only had three rolls that didn't have silver in it. 
you can see the stack of walking Le Lady Liberties and uh, stacks of Ben Franklin's and uh, 64 1964 Kennedys. This is 40% silver over here. And then we still have that one lone barber quarter. Okay, well, we'll open this one up and see what we have in here. Well, I've got uh, one Benjamin Franklin, but I've got one coin here on the end. See what that is. Heck is that? Casas Realis Panama. How about that? Not of this world. Panamanian coin, 2012. Well, I'll have to research that and see if there's any silver in it. My first box, and it yielded 160 coins. These are all 90% silver in the first box. And now I'm working on my second box. And the second box has already yielded a pretty good stack of Benjamins, Walking Lady Liberties, and 1964 Kennedys. More to come. Box two, and we got 144 silver <coughs> coins from it. From the first box, we got 160. Now we'll go to box number three. End of a long day, coin roll hunting. Four boxes, and these are the results. I found 118 Benjamin Franklin, 115 Walking Lady Liberties, 55 Kennedys, 1964, all 90% silver, and 20 Kennedy 40% silver, and one Barber half dollar, 90% silver, and this is my one roll that I got from the bank yesterday at Wells Fargo. Uh, they only had one roll and I bought it and opened it up and all of it was silver, all 40% silver. So the grand total number of pieces is 396 pieces. It's been a very fruitful day, praise God.